it has happened again. Another school shooting, this time just miles away from Columbine High in Colorado. One student is dead, eight are injured, and two students are in custody awaiting formal charges. It's become a familiar story to all Americans. And as with every other school shooting, the unanswered question remains, why? The student accused in the latest school shooting appears in court, his long black hair streaked with purple. 18-year-old Devin Erickson kept his head bowed during the court hearing, except for a series of rapid nods when answering the judge. Police say Erickson had an accomplice. The suspect posted this video last summer. Devin Erickson and McKinney were close friends at the STEM school in Colorado where the shooting took place. Erickson appeared in school musicals, including Les Mis. He also had a dark side. His car was spray painted with the words, blank society. On the roof were the numbers 666 and a pentagram, both satanic symbols. We found this disturbing post on Erickson's Facebook page. You know what I hate? All these Christians who hate gays. The first report of gunfire came from a student. I see just a bunch of kids running out and saying, school shooter, school shooter. Is he inside this whole film? Police were on the scene within two minutes. There's more gunshots coming from the office. I need medical here, ASAP. And you have one teenage male, possible gunshot to the foot. Open a female, shot in her left leg. 18 year old Kendrick Castillo is being hailed a hero today. He was shot to death when he tackled Erickson as he tried to save the lives of classmates. His parents spoke to CNN. One of the kids told me that, like a flash, he jumped up. She said, you know, he's a hero, he saved me. Another hero is 18-year-old Brendan Bialy, who risked his life to overpower the shooter. The emotional images of children once again traumatized by a school shooting are touching hearts across America. Teachers and students with their hands up, anxious parents waiting for news, and poignant reunions. Dylan! Love you, son. The school is only seven miles from Columbine High School, where 13 people were killed by two teenage gunmen 20 years ago last month. We're going to mourn, we're going to weep, we're going to take care of those who are down and pick ourselves back up.